Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with a brand new Let's Play. We have Super Mario Land 2, 6 golden coins for the Nintendo Game Boy. So, I haven't played this in ages, so... I guess technically we gotta go this mushroom level. Oh, I guess I can't turn down the volume, so I guess it'll have to be this volume, which is pretty annoying, but whatever. I'll try and 100% this game, which I'm pretty sure is all you can do. Okay, so fun fact, you can't grab shells in this game, nice to know. Oh, I have the buttons backwards, that's what's going on. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, give me the ultra mega power up. Oh, uh, you can still jump on them, whoa. So yeah, this game is kind of a weird, weird fever dream of a Mario game, honestly. I'm assuming collecting 100 coins will once again give you life like any other Mario game. I guess that's something, right? Flying Goombas, cool. Oh, piranha plants, nice. Uh, can we go down this pipe? It's kind of just empty by itself, no? Ooh, maybe there's a power-up under one of these. An invincibility star? Okay. Okay, the music is pretty catchy. Oh, that's the checkpoint bell, okay. Oh god, slow down, because the Game Boy can't handle much. Hey, we got a 1-up in the end, nice. Mr. Piranha Plant, do you have a, a bonus pipe? Ooh, you do. I don't know if it's called a bonus pipe, but just a pipe you can go down is what I'm getting at. Probably do like one world per episode or something. I need some short series to record while I take a break from recording console for a second, so... And there's the exit bell. And there we go, we beat the level. Oh, I missed. I don't like this minigame very much, thank you very much. Okay, so we can, I guess, decide wherever we're gonna go. We can go in here. Oh, those cost coinage. Wait a minute. Hang on a second, we can open up that one. We have 30. Oh, it's a mini game. Okay, I see. And we got a carrot to turn us into a flying rabbit. I guess we'll do Turtle Zone. Let's do it. Now, what does this power do? Oh, we can kind of glide. Well, that's cool to know. But now we got the Native American Fire Flower, because logic. Okay, so we can't hold down the run button now, because that's our fireball attack. No, we lost our power up. Because there was a shark that took more than one hit to kill, and I wasn't expecting it. Why are there sharks in this game? Get out of the way, uh, what, what's your name? You're not, you're not the, uh, Cheap Cheeps, you're the guys with the goggles. For some reason, you're blue. Huh. Oh, checkpoint. Thank you. I do like that the checkpoints are bells, though. That's, that's something I like. Alright, so holding it down underwater doesn't really do anything either. Like, the, uh, j uh, jump button? Or not the jump button, the, uh, run button. Slash attack button. Alright, let's quickly go through here. Can I jump over? Maybe if I had a power-up, but I don't have a power-up, so I guess we gotta wait for this guy. Oh, there's a timer, though, down in the bottom right. Alright, Mr. Sh Sharkbone here, dude, please leave. Alright, let's continue on. Oh, there's the goal! And there we go, we hit the bell. So the shark level, done. Oh nice, we got, looks like, three lives. Ow! I smacked my elbow on the table. 
All right, looks like we got a sunken submarine. Or I guess it's not sunken, it's just a submarine. Whoa, why did it do that? I'm so confused. Why did I swim into the bonefish? That was weird. So where'd the shark go? So why is bonefish back? Where'd shark go? Oh no, there he is. I'm so lawless, man. Ah, Gordo! What are you doing in here? You're not Kirby. Oh, I can jump on that, apparently. Gordo, go away. You're, you're annoying. Oh man, the slowdown in these levels is ridiculous. Nothing! There was nothing in that level, or in that box. So it was a death trap. Yeah, that time I didn't automatically sink down. At least being small, I can avoid Gordo's like nothing. Nothing again? Oh my god, you swim upwards so slowly. Like, you have to mash the button so much, it's not even funny. I don't know if I want to risk that way. Could be a powerful one of these, though. Pardon me, guys. Is there a checkpoint around here by chance? Or at least some kind of power-up? No? Just not gonna give me anything, huh? What are those? Alright, there are just random spikes ready to impale Mario over there. That's not very nice. Man, Game Boy and Mario games are always so weird. Wait a minute. This just brought me back here. Oh, I'm not allowed to go that way. Well, that's nice to know. Thanks, game. Would have been nice to know that before. I don't remember playing this level in, when I played this game originally. Did I just miss an entire world in this game before as a kid? Or I guess as a teenager. I didn't even play it as a kid. I played it as a teenager. Wait, I can just walk under that because I'm short. Alright, just gonna casually avoid the, uh... Bullet bill, I guess? Oh. Oh, no way. Oh, I thought I couldn't get that for a second. Go! Man, the invincibility is just kind of weird. Wait, is that the checkpoint? This is a big level, holy cow. Well, let's go through here. And not die to that guy, apparently. Ooh, pipe. Is this a maze? I don't feel very amazed at this maze, thank you very much. I guess we just gotta keep going until we find the right one, right? Ooh. Ooh, money bags. I don't even know how many coins that was. I didn't pay attention. Hey, there's a power-up over there. So I need to get to that pipe up there. Yeah, you can't go up there. So we need to go down that one right there. Oh, it's on the other side. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? God, the pipe's hitbox is so, like, annoyingly precise. Thank you. Goodbye. Adios. Oh god, more spikes to impale Mario. Yaha. I did it. Uh-oh. Oh, we got the bell. Nice. Which I believe unlocks like a little mini game at the end of the level, right? I'm pretty sure that's what that's for. Oh yeah, we got a power up, thank the heavens. We needed one. Nice. Boy yo 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 yo. I think we're at the boss, right? Or maybe there is no boss here. Maybe we're just uh 
inside of a turtle. This power-up doesn't really provide any use in this level, though. I lost my power up due to these weird bone spikes. Oh no, I took damage again. I thought I saw an invincibility frames game. Why does that Goomba look so grumpy? Hey, checkpoint. Oh no, boner fish. I got eaten by the bone fish. Alright, let's just, uh... Kinda cheese it here. Pardon me, enemies. Mmm. The sides of either teeth or ribs hurt you. No idea if those are teeth or ribs. Okay then. I'm an idiot. It's like, I'm not going to fall and take damage, am I? That would be embarrassing. But no, we, we survive. Is it you squeaking like that, enemy? Uh-oh. Pardon me, enemies. I'll happily take the water, because at least... Ooh. This is not at all weird and eerie. This level shouldn't be too much longer since we already got the checkpoint, I was about to say. It seems weird to have the level go on too long. Oh, never mind, it is a boss. His name is Octodaddy. I guess apparently you can't hurt them. What am I supposed to do? Oh, wait a minute. You just have to jump on his head. Oh, I think we beat him because we can't move. Yep, we beat him. There we go, and there's one of the six golden coins. Nice. Which one was it? Oh, it's the fifth one? No, it's the sixth one. The turtle. Alrighty, if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and Patreon links below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye <laughs>